you know, I have a lot of friends, but how do I, how do I determine whether they should be investing in my deal or not? Do I need a PPM? Do I need a business plan? Uh, I mean, are, am I a financial fiduciary on behalf of the, the partnership? Tell me a little bit more about what role do say general partners play in a, in a syndication? Yeah. So the, the general partners, uh, so in an, a limited partnership, you have general partners who are the management team, and then you have limited partners who are typically the investors. In an LLC, you have a manager, which is the same role as the general partner, and you have members, which is the same role as the limited partners. So it just depends which entity you're looking for. But in either case, the management team, if you're selling securities, then uh, you are uh, taking on a fiduciary responsibility for those funds uh, of your investors. And that really means that you have to place their interests ahead of your own. And you have to make sure that you're acting in their best interests at all times and acting to the best of your ability and you know normal business practices and all of that. Um, so you really do have to think about that uh, when you're handling other people's money. I am thinking that Savannah Royal is, is thinking, where do I get you involved in this transaction? Do I... Do I get you in before I even find a deal? Do I get you in uh, when I find a deal? What's the best time to get Kim involved in these tra- these transactions? So certainly, um, we recommend that you hire us to start drafting your offering documents at the point that you have a deal under contract. So you have a signed purchase agreement. Someone from your team has physically been to the site and you reviewed the financials. So once you've done those three things, we believe that's the time to hire us because it takes two to four weeks to get your offering documents completed from the time you hire until the time you have final offering documents in hand and you're ready to go out and start raising money. And you want that to happen so that it coincides with the end of your due diligence period. So your offering documents and your due diligence period are over. From that point on, you really should be uh, just uh, raising the money and dealing with the processing of your bank loan. Thank you.